So we're here in Google Classroom and we're going to look at how you can download your Markbook. So if we come to the Markbook or the Gradebook area here in Google Classroom, we can see that we've got in this demo class our marks across all of our assignments, um, but we'd like to be able to download those and there's no options to do that. This is just your normal standard class settings. There's nothing there. So there's no immediately obvious way to download everything. However, here's where you find it. You can go to any of these tasks and just click on one of them. And now you're into student work and into an actual assignment. This settings called does a different job. OK, so now we can click on that and we've got the option to download just these marks from this assignment to a CSV. We can download all marks to a CSV or we can copy all of those marks to Google Sheets. So that's what we're going to do. So we just allow that to process. Just takes a little while to pull everything through. Here it comes. And now we can see we've got my class. We've got all of the assignments along here. Anything that hasn't got a due date or a set date appears here. So we might decide that we want to hide those. We can just hide those really easily. But then all of our assignment dates are here. And what you will have noticed is that it's pulled through everything that's been marked and anything that was marked as missing isn't there. OK, and it's sorted things in reverse to the way it is on Google Classroom. So the oldest tasks are first and then it goes along in a nice line like this. And if you really wanted to, you could even go so far as to add yourself a little spark line for those cells. So you could come back here. Take that first cell and go K all the way to there. Close that and you will get your own little mini graph for progress to be able to see how students have performed over that period of time. OK, so that's how you can download your entire Google Markbook for a class in Google Classroom and then use Sparkline to see what the progress is like. Hope you find that useful.